Okay, so this is Whispering Willows. Um, it's a new game I downloaded on Steam just because I wasn't happy with some of the games I've been playing. Mansion groundskeeper goes missing. Mm. From what I know, she's trying to find something about a dead dad. Her dad's died and she's trying to I all gone missing. Now I'm not 100% sure. But it looked cool. Ghosties. Nasty ghosties. And she's fallen into a great big hole. Chasm. Why did I just wink? Warsom's War, Chapter 1. Okay, so. Oh no, Dad's amulet is gone. I can't leave without it. Right. Is that amulet? There we go. Okay, she's got the amulet. Press E. It's there, okay. Crawling, crawling, crawling. New diary entry. What is this place? I'm so lost. Our mom doesn't know where I am. I'm supposed to be looking for dad. Oh, so he's gone missing. He's not dead. I have to find a way out of here and keep looking for him. I know that if I can't get, just get out of here, I'll find some sign of my dad. I won't give up. Right, okay. These are the catacombs. Ugh. Spookers. Ah, there we go. You can see the graves now. Human bones. Do I collect them? No? Oh, but why? It's the catacombs, that's why. Hey girl, hear me. Your power calls to me. The amulet around your neck was crafted by the first high shaman of the Quantanko Taco Tri, I wrote about grandfather. It glows in the presence of spirits and boosts your shamanic powers. Let it be your guide. Cue to change form. Ah, I'm ghosty now, look at me. The spirit and body may drift from one another, but must be joined as one in the end. A fragmented life cannot be lived. I lost my body and look at me now. Perhaps you can help me find it. I shall reside within your amulet and teach you to fend off the darkness. There is a crack above that door. Use it to, to get to the other room. Ah, okay. So when I'm that, I can squeeze through little gaps. Glowing objects can be possessed. Move closer and possess the switch lever. There we go. Rejoin your body. Oh, okay. There we go. Well, that was a little bit weird. I can hardly believe it. I just met a ghost. His name is Flying Hawk and he's one of my ancestors. He told me my amulet has power and he taught me how to use it. Now I can take control of my spirits. This is just what I needed to help find Dad. I was feeling pretty worried for a little while, but I don't think anything can stop me now. Okay. You go, girl. Let's have a look in here. Is there anything I can collect? There's a ladder. Can't go that way, so uh, if we use the ladder. Ooh, quite cool little graphics these are. Great, anything in the grate? No? Okay, so go further down. What's this? Oh, I've locked myself in. You know what, we won't do that. I like how the light changes in each area. Can we do that in there? Ah, and you know. Okay. My dearest mouth has fallen dreadfully ill. She con she's contracted a case of dysentery. The physician, physician, physician 
We bore with us, believe she will live, but I am in constant state of worry. I care for her day and night, surely she cannot care for herself. It pains me that she cannot see the beautiful land we pass through. I feel as though the sight would do her well. The physician warned me she shouldn't move, nor be moved by any. Else her fragile state could go into disarray. I pray to God that he will save her. I can do naught but wait and pray. Like the old fashioned sort of tone. So, what's in here? Uh, something's been covered up. No. Oh. These plays look like they work something below. It's not an open there. There is? That didn't look like there was an open. Why is that bloody? It's locked, the door smooth with blood. Let's go back through the opening. Okay, and let's change into a lot of the state. And go through here. Ah, right, okay. That's interesting. Fair days. Back to my body. Okay, it's back. Let's go through here again. Oh. So, it's so got a bloody door. Let's head downstairs. Mm -mm. Oh, why did she mm -mm me? The girl got attitude. It's an urn. She also thinks like little people have died here. It's locked, storage is written on the door. Okay, back up we go. Back through the opening. Through here. Go down here. Maybe. Ah, we've opened it. Uh oh. What's happening? No keyhole, so it's that thing upstairs, okay. So coffin of Jeremiah Boat. Made in a rush. Oh nice. A lot of attention paid to the dead there. We'll switch. Okay. Close that door. Did I open the door by closing that door, I wonder? Um, can I do anything with that now? Doesn't look like it. Coffin of Willard Hagger. Groundskeeper. A Ground groundskeeper. Isn't her dad a groundskeeper? Oh, this is cool. Oh, ah, here we go. Need that key? No? Move it up. And I'm now changes to my normal form. Thank you. Shall I take that key? A key to the storage room, we know where that is. We've got a key to the storage room, let's go down that way. Storage room, the next one. This one, the storage room. Yay! Storage key. Um, why's that cage rattling? Yeah, my question too. Scratches on the wall, huh? Trying to escape through the ceiling. Note. This day heralds the coming of a new dawn for me. The history books will sing my praises and the world over shall know of my deeds. I set off to settle the savage west. With me as always is the trusted companion Darby O'Halloran. It was enormous relief to know he would accompany me. He's far and away the most trusted friend and I don't know what I'd do without him. Along with us are 24 men that used to work for my father who are now under my employ. They will be crucial in the grunt work along the way. Also with me is of course my beautiful bride Martha who demanded she join me. 
Staying here in New England, however, is young Marcus, who is already 16 years old, almost a man. He shall continue his education and apprentice under my own father. He could have no better a teacher, surely. The boy pleaded for me to come along, but I told him he needs to do what is right for the family business. Someone would need to look after it while I... Next. How do I go next? Well, I established myself in the West. He's a sharp lad and understood well the necessity of his sacrifice. I'm braced him more tightly than ever. I had dared to, but he'll soon be a man and I knew he could take it. Spirit me. Go forth, spirit. What's that? Oh, hi. Anastasia are bored. The lever opens the crypt door. Worth and hid the lever in here to keep his secrets from escaping. Oh god. Uh oh no. It does, doesn't it? No, let's return to my body. Let's see what's. What's well, stop mm -mm and get things? You've got attitude. It's quite creepy. Maybe it's that door with all the blood, actually. Has that moved? No? Okay, good. That's, that's a little bit of relief. I think I need to head downstairs. And uh, see what's going on down here. The key of a crescent moon on the end. Uh oh. Oh, he'll no run, 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 run. There is a creature and it's coming to get. Oh, what? Oh god, I see what I need to do. You to go and sort that out for me and you didn't do it. Oh. Right, so let's do this. Got as safe as I can. Just right next to the door. A spirit. Go through the hole. And open this. Thank you. Get back to my normal body and run. Go up the stairs and keep the ladder. Oh no. A growing darkness has plagued this place since my death. It festers beneath the surface like an infected boil. In exchange for my teachings, you must in turn assist me, Elena. I, hit, I need to find my body and you're the only one who can help. Well, that wasn't at all disturbing, was it? Wait, the things up there moved. Get through the hole. No? So I'll travel around and check things quickly. Ah, new notes. The great eagle returned and took me into its bare crown again. We flew into the air and rested on the clouds. I could see beyond the horizon and what I saw choked the breath of my lungs and my heart wrenched from my chest. The earth turned in on itself and so did my skin. The world was in certain upheaval. Pale figures marched across the land and brought with them blankets of death that covered my people as they slept. I saw plumes of dust darken the sky. No plants grew and giant black rivers cut across the land like infected veins. Monstrous looking beasts of metal and industry will fill our land and destroy the bonds we've worked so hard to nurture. Yeah, the literature. Could join my body up here. Oh, right, yeah. Mm -mm. Why should she keep giving me attitude all the time? Right, I guess if we go back. Oh, how do I get that round? Down here. Okay. 
don't think there's anywhere else there, unless I'm completely missing the point of something. What, what on earth was that thing? I felt like it was living one of my nightmares. I could feel it feeding on me, on my spirit. I'm so tired, but I have to keep going. I'm the only one who can find my dad. The demon's gone now and I'm almost out of here. I promised Flying Hawk I would help him find his body. I'm not sure, but I feel like the guest house is where I should look first. Okay, well that was part one of Whispering Willows. Let me know if you enjoyed this game and would like to see some more of it. I thought it was a little bit unusual. And until next time, see you in another video. Goodbye.